Okay, guess they doing just fine. Said I'm not yours, so I see you're not mine. Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another Monsters video. So in today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at the new Mythic Tail challenge that started today. So the event actually started like i don't know six days ago and stuff like that and you had to get the tokens and stuff and finally the challenge is here and i'll tell you guys how to actually get it if you want to get this new monster so first of all thank you dj for giving us 180 coins thank you very much so the rarat fs tail event um took place today that's what it's called and um well apparently it actually brings a new avatar for us it's free it's a mythic free avatar so you can actually get it by just redeeming these tokens so if you collected one of each you should be fine because it shouldn't cost you um as much anyway so you just basically spam them just like that and you get it take a look at that avatar free you can claim it now just like that look take a look at it it's beautiful <laughs> now before we get started if you guys are new to my channel go ahead and hit that red subscribe button also drop a like as well make sure to turn on post notifications so you won't miss any of my future videos but anyways so get these cells it's it's not really that hard you could you should be able to actually get the monster so all you need basically is, is up to a hundred right just get up to a hundred of uh this monster cells to get it for free so it's not really that hard now i have about 356 gems some of you guys may have um over that or some of you guys may have under like 50 gems yes there are players actually um i used to be like that um until i actually got myself the legends pass and also the um survey method that they actually patched um after uh i uploaded my videos like literally two hours later they actually patched it um so anyways um so first you get the 20 cells which cost about 242 in total you get the items, it's not really that hard. And let's say you get the 20 cells for just today, right? And the 30 cells shouldn't be that hard for tomorrow because you're literally going to do the same thing. It's just going to cost a little more and it's more cells. So you're going to have about 50 there, right? Those two is going to be 50. And then let's... Uh, this this event, right? It's literally lasts three days. Basically four days in total, right? Um, so then you get the 50 cells, which shouldn't be that um, hard, but at the same time, a little bit, not too much. So um, what I recommend you guys doing is wasting at least 20 to 30 gems getting the 20 cells if you want to actually get this in time. Um, and then to move on, you're still going to have about two days, uh, two days in total or even more than that. You can go ahead and grind off for the 30 cells. You're going to have 50 in total. And then the next 50 shouldn't be that hard. Um, well, it will be time consuming. But um, if you'd like to get it, that's just the way. So let me go ahead and take all of this basically. And um, let me go ahead and collect some gold. So when you collect gold, the maximum amount is actually 6 gold pots. So let me go ahead and get those 6 gold pots. So, sometimes you have to collect way more than that. Unfortunately, it's not giving me any. I don't know why. It's probably broken. Come on what wait did i get it already no i didn't why is it not giving me the oh there we go finally i was like what the heck so if you're having problems getting that so let's say you collected a bunch right and then you're not getting it you just go to the island and then go back and then collect them and you should be able to get it but if you collect all your gold already it's okay you can just go ahead and spam gold and it should give you now you can get up to six um every eight hours right so you want to get the six gold pots. Next, it's feed your monsters. Feed your monsters shouldn't be that hard. If you don't have too much resources, just go ahead and um, hatch a Panican or Greenosaur or something like that. You know, uh, Tarzip would be fine as well. And for feeding monsters, like I said, for me, it shouldn't be a problem because I have a lot of food. So I could just literally spam it. Now, if you don't get any, it's okay. Just go ahead and move on to a different monster or you just go back and then uh, go back to the monster and it should give you just like that. There we go, four right there. All right, now that I got my four from there, what I'm gonna do is, um, what is next? So you get up to four maximum or minimum for feeding your monsters every eight hours as well. Fighting, fighting nodes. All right, I don't recommend wasting gems, skipping these. You should just wait every, the, what, is it like one or two hours? You should just wait till it's actually done. So wait for this, victory, it's two hours in total. So wait the two hours and then go ahead and fight it off because even if you finish this off like this quickly right like let's say you waste two gems here and you get into a battle you waste another two gems fighting that and you finish it right you don't want to do that hatching eggs all right hatching eggs shouldn't even be that hard right yeah let me just go ahead and place this bad boy right there take that all right well 
that didn't give me any i'm pretty sure when you sell the monsters you have more chances of getting the item by the way in case you didn't know so let me go ahead and take this what i'm gonna do now is actually buy an egg probably gonna buy a fire star egg because why not i mean that's the first thing that actually came up in my mind um but there is actually a breeding event which i'm gonna do later but let's wait for this so three two one and it's done let me go ahead and sell this there we go we got it awesome super duper easy so when you finish off the whole thing just the first eight hours or the first time you log in i should say right after you get your avatar the first time you just log in um you do everything which is going to be six gold pots to collect for feeding your monsters one from winning the fight and hatching eggs is one um, you should have uh, you should get it down to 150 now what I'm gonna do for tonight I'm gonna stay maybe up to like 1 or 2 a.m. Which I normally do sometimes uh, or most of the times and I'm gonna get all the gold pots feeding your monsters at that time So that should be enough time um, For me for, for this to actually recharge back. I should say the um, items to recharge back so then I could get all of them again and um, When I wake up in the morning, I could you know probably finish it off or something or i could just do it at night um maybe i could get it down to like 30 gems or 20 gems or something i'll have to see if it's somewhere there i'm definitely gonna go ahead and get it and move on and in case you didn't know let's say i got the 20 cells right now right wasted 150 gems when you move on to the next one everything refreshes so you can literally just collect gold pots again, feeding your monsters and stuff like that for the next one. And you don't even have to wait um, 8 hours or whatever the time is. That's actually a pretty good thing. So if you want to do that, that'll be amazing. We had 300 war coins out of that. Awesome. Uh, but yeah, so you should have it down to 150. And um, hopefully by tonight, I can actually get the 20 cells. And then tomorrow, I can start off with a 30. And then the next day should be 50 uh, and so on, right? I just want to get the monster cells up to um, 100 just to craft it and probably do a video on it. But um, aside from that, unfortunately, I only have one rune slot open on this monster. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, I only have one. But there is actually a Warmaster Spotlight breeding, which is going to be super nice because um, I can actually participate in this because it's going to give me heroic orbs. Yeah. So let's go ahead and read this. So apparently, if you don't, Get, if you don't get Zombic, Zombic is by the way the breeding monster. If you don't get it, you, you still get 15 orbs. But if you do get it, you get 100 heroic orbs, which is amazing. Right? And um, what's it called? So the breeding co combination is Draza and Dr Greedy Dragon. That shouldn't be that hard. And um, if you just go to breed, press on this thing Greedy Dragon, Draza. I don't know why Scorpeg is always up here for me. Like, why is that even up there? It should be Greedy Dragon and then Draza both of them below each other i feel like that should be a thing but um let's go and start breeding let's see what we get out of this imagine one day in 22 hours <laughs> just imagine oh one day 10 hours or one day nine hours unfortunately okay well apparently i couldn't get any of that from the, from that unfortunately so um yeah and then it gave me some maze coins which i don't need uh Unfortunately, that happened there, and I don't have any extra Drazos or Greedy Dragons, or else I was actually going to go ahead and um, try again here. I was going to breed it again, but um, yeah, unfortunately, I don't. Maybe I could try something else if I have any, like, um, I just accidentally... Oh, my gosh. I accidentally breeded that. It's okay. It's at least four hours, so it should be like a... What's it called? Uh, what, is, what is that monster? That one monster... Uh, Thunder Eagle, it should be just that, so we should be fine, right? Shouldn't be that hard. Uh, yeah, so you can get yourself the um, avatar here. You can equip it for free. Frames, I feel like this would actually go very well with this. Take a look at this. this uh, that actually kind of goes well, right? The Easter one actually goes well as well. I like that. But um, I'm just going to go back to my main one, which was uh, Kai. I do love that avatar, so I'm just going to go with that one. But um, yeah, if you want to go ahead and equip that, you can. Let's head over to PvP, do a battle here real quick. Looks like I got, or, uh, yeah, I got 39 points while I was away. Now I'm at 5,980 points. Let me take a look at rankings on my friend list. Let's see who's first. It can't be me for sure. Oh, Dib. Nice, Dib. All right, I'm going to try to skip Dib sooner. So I actually skipped them, um, like, yesterday or the other day. What did I get myself into? 
I'm gonna try to win this. I was using Elvira on my team because of the Legends Pass challenge, by the way, in case you didn't know. I'm gonna go ahead and trade disable them. Easy peasy, get rid of the Staminas as well. Oh wow, I sort of messed up there. Turn transfer. Oh, cooldown, okay. Okay, alright, I see how it is. My Relic kicked in. Not bad, not bad. Post human on that monster. Let's do it. Alright, my stamina regen kicks in. Nice. Okay. What I can do here is apply the double damage. Okay, after that, I'm gonna have five stamina. So he has a Ural SN. If I use this. No, I'm actually just gonna get rid of him. He comes back. I won't have enough stamina, so I'm gonna charge up. Um. Going to trade the Sable. Focus Fusion. Dude, I have to heal up with Elvira. Oh, never mind. That's too late. <laughs> I, dude, I tried. I tried. <laughs> wow. Okay. Dude, I really want to complete the Legends Pass challenge, though. Okay, this should be an easy battle here. Yeah, th that's an easy battle. Just straight off. Uh, level 7 strings. I should be fine, honestly. Because he's going to get the next turn, yeah. I'm glad my monster didn't die there. Uh, I got kind of lucky there. Okay, use this, get the double damage, use that, and only one monster left now. It should be easy, I'll just do auto, honestly. Yeah, it should be easy peasy. Alright, turn transfer, he just went with that. No, you don't have to do much, just charge up. <laughs> Why would you heal? Dude, AI? AIs kind of suck at the same time. Like, sometimes I actually don't like AIs. When it when you just put it on auto, and they, uh, the AI actually takes over, they just... Sometimes they play super duper um, safe. Like, even when you're winning, like, let's say it's only one enemy left with, like, 2000 HP, all your three monsters are alive, your, the AI will heal up your monsters or give damage boosts and stuff like that. Like, just get rid of the monster, it's just one monster left. <laughs> but anyways, um, I got some points out of that, so... Oh, nice! I get 300 coins right there. Can I get Tainai? Yes, I can! Awesome! Oh, that's awesome! I actually got myself Tainai. Let me get those, let me get that. Let me go ahead and get this. That, 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 10 gems, and 300 war coins. Nice, I got myself Tainai. So what I'm gonna do is actually go ahead and um, hatch him right now. This is my, I don't know how many mythics. I think it's my 7th or 8th mythic or something. I don't know, honestly. Let's go on and use it. And take a look at that. Yes, yeah, awesome. <laughs> That's so awesome. Um, did they change the amount of points that you need or something? I feel like they did. Yeah, I feel like they did. It was around 2,000 points before. Oh, never mind. What the heck? I thought it was like around 2,000 points or something. But, um, okay, so I got myself Tainai, and, um, there's a lot of good rewards back here. I can't wait, especially at level 10 speed rate. I can't wait to get that. <laughs> That'll be awesome. Um, but anyways, guys, that is going to be pretty much it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoy. Smash the like button if you did. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.